Yeah, hello boys and girls, Heavenly Gamer here in the flesh, baby. And welcome back for more uh, Life is Strange, uh, people. Yeah, here I am uh, where I left off in the last episode. Uh, in the last uh, part, uh, excuse me, people. Episode 3. Chaos Theory, people. Yes, here I am at the diner, people. We need to get the fucking keys uh, to open this uh, van. Oh my god, baby, let's see what the fuck is happening next. Pop here. What? You know what? Fuck you, dad. <laughs> oh my god. I'm quoting the movies, people. What the fuck I'm doing? Sorry, dad. Yeah, whatever. What is this? Look at all these flyers. It's so sad that nobody will read them. Fisherman. What's up, motherfucker? Good morning. How are the fish today? Don't ask. First the snow, then an eclipse. What's next? The tornado? You don't think it could be like climate change or something? Climate sure has changed around here. Just saw that Prescott brat having a fit by himself in the parking lot. Isn't he always having a fit? He ain't the only one. If you knew what was going on with the fish around Arcadia Bay. Sorry, I'm too pissed to talk about it. See you around, kid. I see you. Trucker. Hey, how's it going? Peachy. Interview over. Worst interview. Worst interview ever. Work is dried up around here, and I have bills to pay. Time is money to a guy like me. That sucks. Wish I could drive right out of Arcadia Bay. Whole town is crumbling. Snow, eclipse, and a slut trying to commit suicide. Maybe you should leave then. What if I could? Now even that shifty Rachel What's-Her-Face asked me once if I'd drive her to Los Angeles. You knew Rachel Amber? Can you tell me about her? Nope. Christ, why don't you get a real job instead of homework? I'd love to see you Blackwell turds try to drive my 1977 Needham 18-wheeler out there. Like I said, interview over. How's it going? Peachy. Interview over. Actually, I wanted to ask if that's your bitch in 1977 Needham 18-wheeler out there. How the hell did you know that? Rachel Amber, bitch. My friend Rachel Amber told me about this cool rig in town because I love taking pictures of truckers. You knew Rachel. She sure didn't give a rat's ass about truckers. Or real work. Oh, so you must have known her too? Only from the diner. She was just a gold digger. She belonged in California with all those... you know who know what's. Good riddance. But you can take pictures of my truck anytime. Take care. So beautiful. I made the trucker happy, and I get to photograph this bitch in 1977 Needham. That's a big tin for Max. <laughs> yeah, baby. Oh my God. Look at that. It's so sad and disturbing and beautiful at once. What an amazing shot. So ominous. My God. B. 
birds are dying. What the fuck is this? Homeless is here again, man. Hi, how are you? I remember you. Max, can I get you something from the diner? I heard about that girl almost jumping off the Blackwell roof. I think it's all connected to Rachel Amber's disappearance. A lot of things in Arcadia Bay are connected to Rachel. Nate, Frank Matson, David Matson, Nate. Including Nathan Prescott? That spoiled shit finally got kicked out of his daddy's school. He also drugged the girl who tried to jump. Sounds like you know a lot more than me, child. I just think Arcadia Bay is in trouble. Maybe you would like to tell me what you're hiding. I don't have nothing to hide, man. I feel like I can trust you as much as Chloe. And you wouldn't think I'm crazy. Too late for me to judge anybody. Plus, you're not crazy. I'm just gonna say this. I had a vision of Arcadia Bay being destroyed by a tornado. For real. Could be. Bad mojo is in the air this week. Thanks for the warning, Max. Yeah, welcome. Dead motherfucking birds everywhere, man. What the fuck is this? My fuck. Other fucking mosquitoes, man. Flies. <laughs> mosquitoes. <laughs> yeah, let's go in the diner, man. What the fuck? Bird. Tornadoes, snowfall, eclipses, now dying animals. Holy shit. Good lord, bacon. I'm ready to nosh again. Oh yeah, bacon. Ugh, but I need to get those keys from Frank. Yeah, all right, man. Hypothesis that climate change is a partial cause for the unseasonal weather. That doesn't explain everything, of course. Frankly, we don't know yet. Graffiti. You should have jumped, asswipe. Kate should have jumped. What? Kate Marsh. Love you a long time. <laughs> Shit. What are the other signs then? You'd never know how weird this town is by these postcards. Oh yeah, spill the plate. Ah! You eat like a pig. Try the floor. Oh! I was eating those beans. Are you fucking insane? I was eating those beans. <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah, baby, this is funny stuff. <laughs> Let's rewind this shit, man. Welcome back. <laughs> uh, yes, let's spill the soap. The soda. What's up, motherfucker? I just wanted to see what would happen if I did this. I'm gonna kill you.
You show up after almost shooting me? You have serious balls, little girl. But hanging out with Chloe, playing with guns and dressing like Rachel doesn't make you cool or tough. The fuck do you want? How do you know these are Rachel's clothes? Because she looks beautiful in them and you look like ass. Aiming a gun doesn't make you any sexier. Grab your keys and let's check out your RV. Oh. Let's not. You fucking creep me out. And the sent proposal, baby. In other words, Max, no keys. Maybe I could chat up that officer, or even Nathan, and then go all Groundhog Day on them until I get the info I need. Oh my fuck. <laughs> this motherfucker is crazy, man. Rachel! Uh, whatever the fuck. Uh, <laughs> Rachel! <laughs> oh, look. Max Amber. Nice outfit. <laughs> By the way, thanks for getting me fucking expelled, you twee bitch. You're lucky this is a public place. Considering we're in a public diner with a police officer right over there, you shouldn't advertise your rage, Prescott. Oh, yeah? You shouldn't have bitch snitched on me to that fucked up principal. Oh my god. I bet you hoped that Kate Marsh would stay quiet. Idiot says what? Did you drug her? You are so stupid, Max. You think you're so goddamn smart, too. Don't push me, girl. You don't want me for an enemy, understand? Do you? Calm down, dude. We're in the diner. Right. Plus, you're an adult now. I can sue your dumbass for libel. Thanks. Now fuck off, Dyke. Mm, holy shit, what do you want now? <laughs> uh, drug for sale. Listen, Nathan. I'll take back everything I said about you. If you hook me up with Frank. Know what I mean? You look like you've never even taken a hit of baby aspirin. How do you think I stay wired all night studying? So is it a deal or not? Calm down, hard up. Deal. You get your school supplies. Just go over to Frank and whisper, higher education. You'll hook your ass up. Try interrogating somebody else, Lieutenant Caulfield. Holy shit, what do you... Your father. Your sugar daddy will always protect you. And threaten me. You don't know shit about my father or me. Nobody here does. Then tell me what I should know. Why? So you can pretend to care, hmm? Spoiler alert, he's an asshole. Maybe I can help you. I don't need you for anything except to stay out of my fucking business, understand? Now get out of my face. Mm. Holy sh... Rachel and Frank. I bet Frank hooked you and Rachel Amber up with party supplies. Nice try. Rachel partied like a fiend on her own. More than me. I doubt that. Like you would know, virgin. Even that pig over there knows Rachel hung out more with Frank. I mean, don't talk to the cop about that, dumbass. <laughs> Motherfucker is crazy, man. There she is. Super Maxine. That's your new nickname around the bay. Sorry, but you did earn it. We're all real proud of you for helping Kate down. Thanks, Officer Barry. I was just lucky. And right on time. Kate is who counts. I'm glad you're representing Black Bull Academy. Uh, next. Rachel and Frank. Nathan said that Rachel Amber represents Blackwell. With Frank Bowers. Bowers ain't no student anymore. Sadly, he does represent one side of Arcadia Bay. I want you to stay out of his orbit, okay? He man that rabid mutt. I heard something about Frank Bowers and his puppy. My boy does love his dog. Especially when the dog is your personal drooling bodyguard. You can bet he trained that poor thing on blood. Gross. I wouldn't bet. Where did he get the pup? Frank used to bet on dog fights. And to his credit, he had a revelation. He saved a bunch of the dogs, kept one for himself. He's still a creep. You and that Chloe stay away, right? 
Yeah, alright! gonna speak with this bitch again man I rewind everything Those motherfuckers didn't talk to me what the fuck now saves dogs you act so scary but you did save all those dogs one I'm not acting two who told you about the dogs it's actually a great story you're an animal lover could I pet the doggy I could go grab him from your RV right now. <laughs> I won't even let you pick up the dog shit. Hell Besides, yeah. you don't want a leash. You want these keys right here. Look at your eyes dilate. You're worse than a junkie, Max. But no fix for you. Let's uh, take the fucking keys. I'm afraid I'll have to take your keys, <laughs> now, asshole. You did not just do that. <laughs> Give me back my keys, bitch. Give me my keys now. I already have them, bitch. <laughs> now back to Chloe. Yeah, motherfucker. Got you. Got your ass, bitch. Yeah, motherfucker, I have the keys. Oh my fuck. I'm not close enough, man. Get the fuck away, stupid fat ass bitch! Quit thinking, Max! Yeah, you are a fucking retard. In each episode, this motherfucking bitch gets it. Yeah, but I'm here to save her ass. Chloe, I have the fucking keys. I should have known. The amazing Spider Max. I couldn't have done it without Frank. Now let's get in and out. You'll need this, Max. On your mark, get set. Throw! Oh my god, throw towards the, the road. Throw in the parking lot. Oh my god. Yeah, I guess if I throw in the fucking road, the dog is gonna die. Yeah, let's throw it in the parking lot. Get the treat, treat, boy! I think we just made that dog our bitch. Get it? Now we can snoop in peace. But let's not waste time. The doggy is busy now, but he might come back. Damn. I thought my room was a shithole. You're not a creepy drug dealer. Frank has issues, but he's not creepy. At least I didn't think so until I saw him with Rachel's bracelet. Oh, we could cruise everywhere in this bad boy! Can you see us heading down the coast of Big Sur and beyond? Oh, yeah. Yes, we'd be tearing up the highway. And you'd probably want me to kiss you again. Oh. Chloe, we're on a schedule. We need clues about Rachel. Kiss you again. Oh, yeah, baby. I know. Just daydreaming. The 
fuck we need to find, man? You scope the area while I hack his computer for info. <laughs> I think the doggy likes his bone more. Frank is almost a made-for-TV hoarder. This place is nasty. Can't quite picture Frank and Chloe drinking beer and hanging out. That would be so cool to take this baby on the road with Chloe. Yeah, of course. Frank must have a reason to keep a police radar nearby. I doubt Frank is trying out for the Arcadia Bay Brewers. Yuck. The archetypal filthy guy dishes. Good to know Frank has a knife lying around. A knife? Frank must spend all his drug money on baggies. <laughs> Recycle, dude. Of course Frank gets the munchies. Nice rig. Glad Frank treats something here with respect. Whoa, what the hell is he doing with that dog? <sighs> Stop it. <laughs> How can somebody live like this? That's almost cute to see Frank posing with his dog. That's a pretty extreme lighter. Is Frank going to deal online now? Too bad I don't have my Frank Bowers decoder ring. Are these for Frank or is he selling them? Or both? He's <laughs> a fucking junkie, man. That's almost cute to see Frank posing with his dog. I've already seen this shit, man. Okay, this vent is loose. I need something to pry it open. Yeah, get that fucking knife over there. This is almost as good as a set of keys. Hell yeah, baby. My blade will open any portal. Oh yeah, baby. Found it, baby. What the fuck I found? Oh man. Rachel and Frank's dog. I don't know if I should be touched or disturbed. Yeah, let's see what the fuck is this, man. Hope you read this first thing in the morning. Sorry about last night. I was being a monstrous bitch and took it out on you. And poor Pumpy though. There's a lot of weird shit going in my life and sometimes I feel I like never going to get out of Acadia Bay. Thank you. Thank God for you. You are one of the best things I have here and I smile when I think of us together. Let's just drive out of here forever. What? I'm glad Rachel got to drive this beast. She looks genuinely happy. Rachel really did hang out with Frank. I'm learning more about Rachel than I want to know. Hmm. Trouble in paradise. That was not cool what you did and don't blame the drugs. You actually scared me and... I thought you would never chill out. I, I've never seen you act that way and the next time will be the last. I'm a Leo and don't look back. I care about you so maybe you need to break our roots. Roadstein. Yeah, ref baby, let's go! Oh my god, it's not gonna be good. It makes me ill that Rachel posed like this for Frank. I wrote him love letters. I can't believe she was banging Frank. Rachel straight up lied to my face. Why didn't she say anything? Because she knew how you would react. And she wasn't much of a friend, huh? 
Yeah, of course not. Who shits all over me? Why does everybody in my life let me down? My dad gets killed. You bail on me for years. My mother gloms on a step fucker. Now Rachel betrays me. Chloe, Rachel is missing. Nobody betrayed you. Bullshit. Who hasn't? Fuck everybody. Oh my God. Chloe. My god, this motherfucker is still eating his fucking beans. <laughs> this fucking plate is still full. <laughs> Chloe, you can't keep blaming me and everybody for everything wrong in your life. It's so not fair. I blame somebody, otherwise it's all my fault. Fuck that. Oh my god. Rachel and Frank. So now it's Rachel's fault too? Jesus, she was banging that pig, Frank! Bitch lied to my face, Max! I can't trust anybody again. Everybody pretends to care until they don't. Even you. Chloe Price. What? You better take that back. Right now. Okay. Fine. But you just don't understand. It's like I'm being punished by the universe. So who do you most want to blame? My fucking dad, of course. Hello? William. You blame William? Really? Yes, I do. Damn right. He chose to go out that door and leave me forever. Chloe, your dad didn't choose to leave you. My God. I know that, Max. My mom actually blames herself. Just because she wanted a ride home from work. Sometimes, even I blame her. No, you don't. Yes, Max, I do. Do you know what it's like to wait for your father to come home when you're a kid? And he never does? No, of course not. But I was with you that day. It was just a terrible accident. I wish that made me feel better. But ever since he died, my life has been dipped in shit. Oh my god. You are still here, I can tell. I can tell. But look at everything that's happened the past week. Your life has changed mine, and that's not shit. I'd really love to believe that. I'd like to believe in something after what's happened. Chloe, I can't do this out on my own. I need you with me. And Rachel needs you. Oh my god. Oh. oh my god. What is happening what the fuck? now? Oh my god, don't tell me. Oh my god, it looks like a mirror. A mirror into the past. Focus with A and D.
Focus this shit, man. What the fuck we need to do, man? What the fuck we need to do, man? Jesus Christ. Jesus fucking Christ, come on, focus this shit. Come on, you focus in fucking shit. Forgot the fucking messenger on, man. What the fucks, man? Motherfuck, cocksuck, motherfuck. Yeah, all right, uh, boys and girls. I guess we're gonna see us in the next episode, people, and see what the fuck is happening next. Uh, yeah, I hope you are enjoying the this episode. Uh, yeah, if you did, uh, don't forget to share, like, comment, subscribe to my channel if you are not a subscriber. Like, uh, dislike, uh, favorite, uh, the buttons are down below. People, do what you, wa what, uh, you want, uh, people. Comment if you have to say something to me. I'm trying my best uh, to speak uh, proper English for you, for me. For all of us uh, people to do my passion uh, in every way, but best uh, people. I'm not gonna replay these people, I'm not gonna choose uh, beautiful words, uh, correct uh, propositions, people. Yeah, see you in the next episode, people, when, when we're gonna see what the fuck we need to do with that photograph, uh, people, and what uh, is gonna happen next. Oh my god, I'm so excited to see what the fuck is happening next. Episode 3, people, part uh, 4, if I'm not wrong. See you in the next episode.